Remember kids, don't do drugs. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down the top 10 tripping ball scenes in video games. How do I know you're real? Ow! That real enough for you? Think you know video games? More specifically, terrible video games? Click below to sign in with your Google or Facebook account and take the new trivia quiz on WatchMojo.com. Follow the link in the description. For this list, we'll be looking at the scenes where players found themselves taking hallucinogenic in-game journeys. These don't have to be caused by substances per se, as long as it's pretty clear the character you're playing is tripping out big time. Also, since these sections come as something of a surprise within the confines of the game, consider this a spoiler alert. Yeah. It's a real mellow contemplative high that comes from the earth. Number 10, Digital Trips, Watch Dogs. There really is an app for everything these days. For those that have grown tired of hacking and scanning, you have the admittedly rather odd option of indulging in five mini-games known as Digital Trips, apps that will place Pierce in varying dream scenarios, each more bizarre than the one before it. These include taking out robotic sentries, running over demons throughout a hellish version of Chicago, destroying the city in a massive mechanical spider, or flying through the air by bouncing on top of giant flowers. You know what? Maybe technology has gone too far. <laughs> Number 9. Drake Drinks the Water. Uncharted 3. Drake's Deception. It's clean. It's amazing. It's still running after all these years. You'd think that after everything he's been through, Nathan Drake would be a little more cautious about consuming strange liquids, especially the water of a legendary city buried in the middle of the desert. But he does, and as a result, our intrepid treasure hunter begins to suffer vivid hallucinations. Not only does Nathan see Sully get shot right before his eyes, but he begins to have flashbacks to his younger years. No, no, no. Now, normally we'd be distraught over seeing Nate's beloved mentor bite the dust, if we didn't have to deal with the flaming-headed soldiers and the incoming horde of spiders. Next time, Drake, travel with a water purifier. <laughs> Number 8. The Green Syringe, Surgeon Simulator 2013. For those that have experienced the exercise and frustration that is Surgeon Simulator, you'll know that your patient suffering excessive blood loss is a pretty common thing. As such, you'll want to slow it down with an injection from the green syringe, which works to reduce blood flow. But if you're too careless and accidentally inject yourself with it, well, enjoy the consequences. Wow, this is trippy. This is really trippy. The screen becomes coated in bright green and purple colors, with the added effect of making sharp, distorting sounds every time you move your arm. Well, that's one way to make surgery more interesting. Number 7. Visionary Potion. The Witcher 2. Assassins of Kings. Geralt of Rivia is no stranger to downing various concoctions while on the hunt for mythological beasts. Be that as it may, we doubt he'll be wanting to revisit this one anytime soon. Should you choose to go along with the option to become the visionary's follower, he asks that you complete a ritual that involves drinking a visionary potion. This results in Geralt waking up in a forest made of giant phallic-shaped mushrooms and… is that a colossal-sized chicken? We know the Witcher series is known for its promiscuous nature, but even by its own standards, this is a bit much. But your time will come. You will then hear and understand. Trust me. Number six, Grassroots, Grand Theft Auto V. Take a drag. No, I don't, I don't, I don't smoke it anymore. It interferes with the speed. No, it's really good weed. There's no denying that what Trevor and Michael go through when taking a puff of Advocate Berry's homegrown samples is beyond the pale. 
As it happens, Barry's personal stash has some nasty side effects, including visions of invading aliens and psychotic clowns. You ain't taking me now! Armed with some very heavy weaponry, our favorite crooks have to repel wave after wave of freakish attackers. Franklin, on the other hand, kind of gets off scot-free. The f just happened? What are you talking about? We discuss globalization, the state. Stay the f away from me. What? Number five, Papa Joy, we happy few. You've been having an altercation in the alley? Uh, nothing you need to worry about, Constable. Hmm, what would it be like if drugs were legal? Oh, wait, weed is legal here in Canada, so go us. Now, what would it be like if taking hallucinogenic drugs was mandatory? Uh, well, that's the world of We Happy Few, where inhabitants of the British city of Wellington Wells are required to take the drug known as Joy on a daily basis. Doing so makes inhabitants strut down the street saying, lovely day for it, to passers-by, while also seeing the world in sunshine and rainbows. Should clear up soon, I imagine. All right. Lovely day for it. One side effect from taking too much joy is that it causes memory loss. But don't worry about that. Just do what the nice death ray machine says and take your joy from that nearby repurposed phone booth. Number four, touch fuzzy, get dizzy. Super Mario World 2, Yoshi's Island. <laughs> How could everyone's favorite Nintendo dinosaur be connected with anything even remotely hallucinogenic? Clearly you've never visited Yoshi's Island. While having to protect baby Mario, which is difficult enough given how he's constantly getting himself into danger all by himself, Yoshi ends up encountering enemy creatures known as the Fuzzies. If you make the mistake of coming into contact with them, then Yoshi's movements will immediately become sluggish while the screen starts shaking haphazardly. We're not sure what fuzzies are made of, but next time we'll just say no. Number 3. Enter Scarecrow. Batman Arkham Asylum. If you thought things were chaotic with the likes of the Joker running through the madhouse, then just wait until you get a taste of this Arkham inmate's personal poison. After having unknowingly been exposed to Scarecrow's fear toxin, Batman literally starts to see the walls coming down as his hallucinations get more and more intense. Suffering flashbacks to the night of his parents' murder, having his game restart with his and Joker's roles reversed, a freakishly tense boss fight against a giant version of Scarecrow, yeah, this is one trip that the Dark Knight won't soon be forgetting. I think you need a little more. Number 2. Sanity Effect. Eternal Darkness, Sanity's Requiem. You will come to learn fear as I have. You too will come to understand or you will perish. You won't find a better example of visual psychosis than this. As our main protagonists try to navigate their way through this time-twisting narrative, their sanity meter is constantly under threat, depleting when in the presence of monsters. Should it be reduced completely, players will be greeted to a whole host of random and horrific sanity effects. These range from fake deaths, where characters spontaneously have their limbs explode, as well as fourth wall breaks such as the infamous blue screen of death. Yeah, this game is one giant sanity effect. Number 1. Too many, or too high, to count. Far Cry series. Honestly, take your pick. Whether it's suffering flashbacks after ingesting mushrooms, or going through one hell of a rite of passage in Jason Brody's worst holiday ever in Far Cry 3, going on an insane spiritual journey in Ajay's violent quest to lay his mother's ashes to rest in Far Cry 4, or being lured by the singing of Faith and her bliss in Far Cry 5, it's guaranteed that any game in the series will take you on a trip. This is the only way the story ends. Nothing you can do can change that. Hell, you can even get high by eating the freaking Apple of Eden in New Dawn. 
If there's one thing that you can take away from Far Cry, it's that anything sacred is probably gonna make you trip out, bro. Go, kill the beast. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.